All right, guys, this is just a brief on what you want to do, or I like to do when I'm on the Texas Gulf Coast. This is just a little brief add-on uh, to a longer um, report, but um, this is about prospecting. And of course, there's two things we do on the Texas Gulf Coast that fly fishing isn't happening. Too much wind, or just too difficult to find a fish. We go prospecting, or we cut the wind with a spinning rod. Now the spinning rod, these guys I pay full retail price for. The one I'm using right now, and I love this thing to death. You're seeing that footage from uh, catching that redfish in Port O'Connor. This is a water loose salinity. It's pretty too, pretty in it. So that's the salinity rod. You know, good guides, everything. Well done, well done rod. And that rod, I, I can't remember what the cost is on it. I'll put it down in the information. What really impressed me was this Florida fishing product, 2500 reel. I thought it might be a little bit too light for this rod, but actually it's got like 12 pounds of drag on it, I think. That's what the specs are on this. And it's smooth as butter. The drag is very smooth. So when I have to prospect on the Texas Gulf Coast, this is my setup right here. I love this thing. It's a one piece, not a travel rod. And man, it has the backbone once you get down into it, but it also has the tip, the medium, has the tip for a cast in a mile. Now, my prospecting includes hard baits. I'm not into the soft bait thing. I'm trying to stay out of that. I think it's a slippery slope for a fly fisherman. But we got a prospect, right? We're there, we drove all this way, and we want to catch fish, um, or at least find fish to catch on a fly rod. Those are the two things. Mm, there goes a the fish right there. <laughs> Gotta keep my eyes out. Anyway, mirror lure, that's me. This one came from C.A. Richardson, I think is his name. See, Captain C.A. This is a, what's called a 17 MR Lil Wayne. This is a Lil Wayne. And when I saw the color on this, I ordered two from him right away. Unfortunately, I only came back with one. I got broke off by a big redfish on the second redfish I caught on this lure. And uh, it's probably my fault because I don't know what I'm doing. But anyway, that thing works like a champ. Mirror lures, stock up on them. They're great. The Florida Fishing Products. Um, these guys have been treating me right. They're awesome. That's 15 pound braid with 10 pound, which really needs to be about 15 pound uh, solid floor liter. And that's the 2500 inch, just butter. I think I'm gonna get a 2000 for my uh, meat runs that I do here in North Texas for sand bass. Pretty spectacular reel and great performance in Port O'Connor, Texas. Thanks for watching guys. If you uh, want to know more about these products, there's links in the description. Please like and subscribe to texasflycaster.com and always visit the website www.texasflycaster.com. Some days you got to go conventional. Some days it works when you're prospecting, looking for fish. Some days you just have to break it down and go to the dark side.